Hello guys, today we will be building this Lego candy machine here. So first I'll show you a demonstration. So for this, I'll to get the candy, I'll just need to press this button here. Then I will get my candy here. Now I'll show you the mechanism. So with this, whenever this button is pushed, this candy is pushed as well, off of the place it's sitting on. So like this, being sitting on this, so it sits on this, then it gets pushed, it comes off. So now for this, so for the platform, you'll need a 12 this way and 10 this way. So if you're building this way, like this, 12 here, 10 down that way. Now you didn't have a chance to build it now. I'll give you a second to pause now. Okay, so you, so after you've built that part, after you built that platform, now you'll need to make a piece like this. So you'll need a two by four brick. Then you'll need another 2x4, that's not a brick. Then you'll need a smooth. You can have a 2x4, or you can have two 2x2s, two or you can have one, four 1x4s. So now, you'll now another one. Now, you'll need another 2x4. This will go on here. It'll go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 spaces just where this part is here. So five bricks that way and then this part. So one and six, these parts here, just bef after that, it should be covered. So then after you do that, you'll need this. You'll need a two one by, you'll need two one by twos bricks and then you'll need another one by twos, four of them on top of each other and four of them and then you'll, you'll go on top like this so after you do that, now you have to make this sliding piece. So you'll need, you can have a 2x2 two two or 2 x one by 1s one, two, one by twos. So after you do that, you can put this here, like this, to the side. After you do that, you'll need to make something like this. So 1 by 4s Then you'll need to put it here, like this. So there's two space remaining. When you do that, now you'll need a piece like this. You'll need three one by fours. You have to put this to the side here. And after you do that, now you'll need to make this like this. And then you'll need to put it three. So there should be three parts from here. And then you'll need two two one by two one by two bricks. They'll go here like this. So when you do that, now you'll need a per same thing from here. You need to put them here like this. So when you do that, now you'll need a piece like this, two by three with a one by three smooth. You'll put it like this. So when you do that, then you'll need a piece like this. So you'll need a one by three brick. Then you'll need a one by two on top. Then you'll need to put it like this. Like this, so this square should go there. And then whenever you do that, then you'll need a piece like this. So you'll need a one by one brick. Then you'll need two one by ones. And then another one by one brick. And then a one by four smooth. So you'll, now you'll need to put it like this. So when you do that, now you'll need a piece like this. So you'll need two one by one by two bricks. And then you'll need two one by one smaller bricks. Not bricks actually. So then you'll need to put it like this. And then you'll need to make the exact same height, but just one by ones. So when you do that, now you'll need to make this here. So you have 
two uh, you have four one by fours and then um two one by twos one by twos here two four one by twos here and then another one by twos here that are smaller and then you'll need eight from the separating them then you'll need a two by two smooth and you'll need a one by two smooth on the other side and then on this again you'll need another piece like this here and the same thing there so now as you do that you'll need to put this here so when you do that now everything should look like this almost after that now you'll need to make the button system here you'll need these pieces so you'll you can have it I'll just give you some seconds to build it to build this so now after you build that you'll need a piece like this after you do that now you'll need a 1x6 here so then you'll need to attach this like this to the 1x6 here and then you'll need to attach this here then whenever you do that this thing will now is because this should be taken off so after i take that off i'll need this piece to go here and then you should be able to push this part back and forth now you should have this part straight here so very straight So then whenever you do that, you'll need to put this back here. Then you should be able to push and open. Push forward. P push and pull back. So then you'll need to take this piece that you just took off and put it back on. So when you do that, now you'll need to make this piece. And put it just before that actually. You'll need to take two of these one one by one ramp this is optional but i'm saying it's better to build so put and then you'll need to put these just before this part here like this so once you put this you'll need to take a piece like this one by six put this on top and yeah that will be finished there should be one brick part gap so now to put the roof You'll need a 15 by 2, then you'll need a 2 by 6, and then another 2 by 6 here. So first, you'll need a 2 by 6 here, and then a 2 by 3 here, and then a 2 by 3 here. This makes a C, so then you'll need something that holds it up, and then you'll need this part to make it smooth like that. So when you do that, now you'll need a 2 by 6 put to this like this so there should be one piece hanging off now for this a you'll need a one by six two one by six and then you'll need one by four here and then another one by four and then one more one by four then you'll need something that holds this up and you'll need to put it spacing out so a and then after this so now you do that you'll need to take these pieces and put them like this so there should be this much space now for this D, you'll need a smooth 1x4, and then another smooth 1x4, then you'll need a 1x6, then you'll need 4, you'll need a 2x4 with a thing like this, it's curved. So now you have your D. Now you'll need to do something that holds it up. I forgot the end here, so you'll just need to end like this. Quick look. After that, you'll need to take the D you just built. You'll need to put it like this, right here. So there should be it should be hanging on just one piece. Then when you do that, you'll need a Y. You'll need you need to put it just like the same thing that you just to see. You'll you'll need a two by four. Then you'll need a one by two, and then three one by twos. Put like this. So then after you do that, you'll need to put it back like this. 
then that will be finished again. So now after you do that, you'll need a 1x6, then you'll need some things to attach it together. Like this, you'll need to put, so now you'll need to put it like this. So for this, you'll just have to build all the walls here. So after you do that, now you'll need to make a piece like this, that's attached like this. Put it there, then you'll need a 15 by 2 this is optional, you can have this at the back. Then you build this, and then you take your candy, and then put it there. So that's it, so bye bye!